Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 2. Today is episode number 35. If you guys do enjoy the content, then be sure to leave a like, as it really does help with the YouTube algorithm at the moment. Feel free to subscribe, drop a follow on Twitch, and hopefully you enjoy the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Alright, we're going to be taking part in the British Sports Car Championship. Uh, this is for all cars that are a class and my controller is disconnected we're going to be taking the db9 coupe and there we go reconnected going around sunset peninsula infield moving on to maple valley Magello, and then finishing off with silverstone let's get going all right here we go we are starting in second place apparently we've got a tuscan r that's faster than us and a tuscan r that's slower than us Very strange, but we'll go with it. Oh! That TVR is much quicker. It is much, much quicker. Bloody hell, that thing's quick. Why did the CVR slow down for that? Seems strange for it to be slowing down that much. Five more laps to go. I love that they've the uh, Xbox is going crazy, like advertising Yakuza and all that stuff. That it's being released on Game Pass, but they already released it and then removed it for some unknown reason to bring it back. Like, why remove it in the first place if you're gonna just bring it back? It's still there. A little bit too much of a corner cut there, so we got ourselves a time penalty. Oh wow. Well. It doesn't actually add to the total race time. Why the hell did the car not slow down? I'm 
very much confused by that, and I may end up moving towards the TVR for the next race, just because this is ridiculous how slow this is. And now it's not too bad. Go. We got a. Um... One more lap after this. Oh, the hell. Generally don't know what to talk about for today's episode. Taking a picture of you will put a virus on my phone. Unbelievable. Cannot believe that, Aaron. You would backstab me like that. I am disappointed. There you go. We got the win just about. I will take that result. I think we'll stick with the DB9 for now. I think it's just about fast enough. All right, here we go. Maple Valley. This is going to be hell. Me when I'm by your side. Say that you want me, baby. Fuzzy hell. Get out of the way! Bad. It was good. Fairly decent start so far. Obviously on uh, only on lap one of five so far. So there's plenty of time to cock up. It's going to happen. So be prepared for that. I wanna hold you. I 
to be lonely when I'm by your side Say that you want me, baby So through the faster sections, like those chicanes, would definitely gain in time, so... Until we do something dumb like that! Very dumb, actually. be Somewhat lost control of the car. These cars are definitely prone to understeer, oversteer, and just not staying stable. Stability is not a thing in these cars. This is one thing I've started to notice a little bit more with Motorball 2. Although the cars... They're more stable than Motorsport 1, granted, but... They're less stable in terms of when you're going around corners. Actually, Motorsport 1 was a lot better when it came to cornering. Exits of the corners were horrendous on Motorsport 1. But, like, this is just... Even a slight bump. If you're turning at more than 110 miles an hour... 100 miles an hour, you're not getting around that corner safely. Alright, we're still doing alright though. How's that an insult? Because if you have to take caffeine then that means you're tired. So that's a problem with you, not with me. You sent that one earlier. Boo, boo, boo. Not bad. Nearly losing control of the rear of the car once again. Every single car that we've driven today has been extremely unstable.
There we go. Not bad. <laughs> a grey sprinkle on a rainbow cupcake. Unbelievable. Well, actually, technically speaking, that's not an insult. Because uh, that means I'm one of a kind. You know? There we go. Not bad. Here we go, we got this. Not bad. Let's keep it going. <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Alright, here we go, Miguelo. Uh, this one's going to be a pain in the ass into the first corner, to be honest. Oh, they're gone. These TVRs are way too quick. Not bad. Come on. That was ridiculous. Love that all the TVRs are getting the space and the time and the effort and the distance. TVR is my least favorite British company. I just don't like the look of the cars, they're weird. I will admit, though, this one behind is actually an alright looking car, but that one up in front, vile. We go, not bad.
We've done three laps. We still have not caught up yet. The place to catch up is definitely not on the straights, that's for sure. Not bad. Forced our way through there, basically. Not bad. Oh, this is getting tough. Come on, come on, come on. To be the first and the last rose of the night as we've already used over your entire vocabulary. <laughs> Unbelievable. That's a good one. That's a really good one. Get out of my way. Fuck. Too much weight to hold. Things go all out of control. Not bad. We are getting there. Slowly but surely, we're getting there. They are close on my heels here, though. Not bad. Here with me. There we go. Oh, we got Silverstone after this as well. Uh. Things falling out of control.
Not bad. There we go. I'll take him. Time is 8.11. Not too bad. Awesome. Right. It's time. I will admit, I actually do like the look of that TVR behind. But this one looks like a dead frog. and I hate it. The one behind there, the really angry looking one, that one's nice. I'm sorry that this roast uses your entire vocabulary. Well, clearly I understood it, so... I'm not as dumb as you think. Right, that did give us a little bit of a boost. How can a tap like that cause damage to the front of my car? <laughs> oh, a little bit of a uh, love tap there. Holy crap. Not bad. Come on. Right, coming up to the halfway point of this event, it's looking good. Right, the lap number four. Come on, come on, Eileen. Oh, 
the shoes. I am exhausted. But I've got to do this episode and next episode today. Because the more I get done, the sooner I get to say I've done Motorsport 2 and get some time off playing Motorsport. Because once I finish Motorsport 2, I basically get a little time window of nothingness. It's too much weight to hold. We're going to be looking at about nine minutes for this one. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe not. It all depends, because at the moment, I'm really into the WRC series, so off, uh, on my off streams. So when I'm doing, obviously Forza Motorsport is my main content at the moment on stream, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But, uh, on the in-between days, on a Tuesday and a Thursday, I'm playing WRC. It's been pretty good with this one because we've been able to take like supercars this entire stream. It's pretty cool. We're going to start getting onto race cars probably. I think it's level 30. So basically the next group of stuff. Then we can start on, I believe, some R rated cars. Here with me. To be here with me. Super shit singing unlocked. I think the week before I go on holiday in um, September. I think I'm going to play only Forza for that entire week. And then I'm taking three weeks off streaming. Three weeks off streaming. No streams for three weeks. Uh, I'll tell you the exact dates. Um, ain't not bad. Result. 23-104. Woohoo! I'll take my rewards. Thank you very much. There we go. We got an XJ220 and we got 36 Rand. XJ220 is quite nice, so I'm not complaining. Lovely car. Lovely jubbler. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.